I noticed I was starting to get shortness of breath. I used to go out walking, and I couldn't go out walking very far or anything. It was starting to catch up with me. People like Dan, the clock is ticking, and we have to get them in. To have a transcatheter aortic valve replacement is the ability to put a new aortic valve inside the diseased one. It provides an option where 90% of patients are up walking around and home the next day, and it avoids the healing that process that is needed for open heart surgery. Most people feel better within 48 hours and are back to usual life activities within four to five days, as opposed to four to five weeks after open heart surgery. After I had this procedure, I realized how much I, I wasn't doing. The minute I came home, I felt better, even, even in the hospital. It still amazes me. The way I explain it to patients is your heart's a pump and it has a quarter-sized hole called the aortic valve. And all the blood from the pump has to flow out through that quarter. Dan's quarter was shrunken down to the size of a dime. So it's like a clogged kitchen drain. Whenever his heart starts to beat hard, he can't get all the fluid out of it. And it backs up, stretches the heart, giving him chest pain and flows fluid backwards to the lungs. When you get below the size of a dime, it can be fatal. I don't think Dan would have survived six months. My energy is much better. Everything is, is better. Breathing, I don't get any shortness of breath. I don't think that much to be afraid. The care I got was fantastic. And if it's urgent, then might as well get it done. Boy, I'm glad I got it done, I'll tell you that.